Hey everybody, AZ Plant Reviews here. Today I uh, just so happened to stumble upon a really nice example of a hedgehog cactus in full bloom. Now there's a couple different colors that the hedgehogs can bloom in. A lot of the ones you'll find in the store bloom orange, but that's actually a hybrid. The natural ones, for the most part, in the Phoenix area are going to be these ones that bloom pink just for a little while every year. Sometimes it's just a couple days. They make a fruit that's edible, but... You know, most of the time they're just these nice little guys with very large looking spikes relative to the size of the rest of the plant. As you can see, they don't get very tall. This is like, I wouldn't call it a maximum size. It's definitely an adult. They can get a lot wider than this with more kind of columns rising up. But, you know, this is pretty much an exemplar one. Looks pretty picturesque, too, just kind of sitting on this rock like this. So, obviously, since the Sonoran Desert natives, they don't need much water. Once they're established, they'll be water independent. They can be in full sun once they're fully established. But if you want it to not get all fried up and sunburned looking when you get it from the nursery, you should really have it under a nursery plant for a while. Maybe something temporary like the brittle bush, as much as I have mixed feelings about them. But you could just have it kind of cradled by a brittle bush or some other bush. And then eventually, once it's like growing on its own, flowering on its own, doing everything on its own, then you could get rid of whatever bush was protecting it and have it in the full sun and it should be fine after that maybe it'll still get a little sunburned or whatever these ones you know they're in nature there was a bush growing over this a while ago maybe like 20 years ago and it's just kind of gone away over time and it's perfectly fine out here i'm out in the mcdowell mountains at about like 3,000 feet elevation right now but you can find them all over the sonoran desert at like every elevation especially kind of near washes but not in washes um yeah again the orange ones are nice too just a little more sensitive to the sun at first um very cool plants don't want to touch them but you don't really get too many splinters out of them low maintenance awesome colors once a year during the spring um i i definitely recommend it it's not my all-time favorite, but as a Sonoran Desert native plant with such cool looks and such beautiful flowers, I think I might be giving the Hedgehog Cactus a 9 out of 10. Definitely recommend getting one. Try it out. It's an awesome accent for your yard. Very pretty cactus. Definitely approve. Let me know what you want me to review next time. See you later. Bye bye